Donisthorpe was set up in 1923 to care for the elderly Jewish community. We're now 90 years old and Donisthorpe has gone from strength to strength, starting from one room in a hospital to now this sort of almost palatial site that we have here caring for 182 residents. After my father passed away, my mother immediately said, I'm going into Donisthorpe. Quite contented, aren't you? Yes. Um, settled. You were settled right from day one. Oh, yes. Uh, yes. Anything rather than be on my own. The staff always smile, always say hello, and when they go past my wife's door, where she's in a little lounge, they always say hello, Anne. Their care and attention is absolutely second to none. We're fed uh, right up to the neck. I've put on loads of weight since I've been here. Well, I came here about the end of May, I think, yeah. after a fall. The physios here are fantastic and mm. have helped enormously. So now you go to exercise class. I do. I can walk now with my Zimmer. I like to go to the art class and draw anything but flowers. We try and make sure that residents have lots of stimulation. This isn't just for the residents who have residential and nursing needs. We also, of course, have quite a lot of residents here who have dementia. Just because they've got dementia doesn't mean that their life is over. It's still going on. It goes on on a bit different rules than for all of us over here. But our job is to make sure that they live in the life to full as they can. We come every day to visit her which is lovely, we enjoy coming mm -hmm. because we've got to know everybody and it's like a little club here, it's yes. one big family really. You don't call them the carers, do you? You call them my friends. <laughs> All of them, my friends here. And at first I thought, which friend is she talking about? And it's the carers. The staff at Donisthorpe Hall take dignity very, very seriously. This is our residents' home. We want them to feel safe, secure, and we want them to know that they are respected and will be treated with respect and dignity at all times. As long as my mum's safe and happy, that means the world. We very much try and very strongly believe in creating a homely environment on a 24-hour basis. It's like a beautiful hotel. I am sure I've looked around in many places in England and seen nursing homes, but I haven't seen one to come up to this standard.